Hey there, today we are going to take a journey into the colorful and vibrant world of Henri Matisse, an artist whose life experiences greatly influenced his incredible works of art in the 1920s. Born in 1869 in France, Matisse initially studied law but soon realized that his true passion lied in the world of art. After attending art schools and developing his skills as a painter, Matisse became part of a movement known as Fauvism. Now, what is Fauvism, you may ask? Well, it is all about using bold and vivid colors to express emotions and create energy on the canvas. And this is exactly what Matisse did in his works. Take a look at Nude and Redfish, painted in 1922. Here, Matisse combines soft and delicate nude figures with bold redfish, creating a captivating contrast that grabs your attention instantly. It's a perfect example of how Matisse played with colors and forms to evoke certain emotions in his audience. Moving on to The Woman in Yellow from 1923, we see Matisse's fascination with the human form. The woman's vibrant yellow dress stands out against the calm and serene background, showcasing Matisse's ability to create a sense of movement and dynamism. In Odalisk Lying with Magnolias, painted in the same year, 1923, we see Matisse's exploration of exotic themes. The gorgeous woman, surrounded by blooming magnolias, invites us into a dreamlike world of beauty and tranquility. Now, let's talk about one of Matisse's favorite subjects, the Odalisk. In Odalisk in the Red Box from 1926, Matisse presents an Odalisk in a stunning red box, emphasizing her sensuality and allure. This painting showcases Matisse's ability to capture the essence of his subjects with bold brush strokes and vibrant colors. In Odalisk in Red Trousers from 1921, Matisse explores different textures and patterns, creating a sense of depth and richness in the composition. The vibrant red trousers of the Odalisk make her stand out from the rest of the painting, adding a touch of drama and mystery. Moving on to landscapes, we have Little Landscape of Midday from 1923 and Marguerite on the Rocks in Antibes from 1921. These paintings show Matisse's love for his surroundings, depicting the beauty of nature in a simple yet captivating way. The colors and brush strokes create a sense of serenity and peace, transporting us into the landscapes of Provence. Now, let's talk about another common theme in Matisse's work, the human figure. In the fish pond from 1923, Matisse portrays figures sitting near a calm water pond, capturing a moment of morning serenity. The soft colors and gentle movements of the figures create a sense of tranquility and harmony. And finally, for our last piece, we have Odalisk with a tambourine from 1925. Here, Matisse combines his love for the Odalisk with his fascination for music, creating a composition that dances with rhythm and joy. The bold colors and expressive brush strokes bring the entire painting to life. 